10 Most Expensive Things Owned by Saudi's Prince Salman The enormous riches that Prince Salman, the Crown Prince of Saudi Arabia, acquired from his royal family are currently in his possession. Because he is so wealthy, he is the owner of some of the most opulent and lavish objects that can be found anywhere in the globe. I would like to welcome everyone to the richness that is in your life. He was born Mohammed bin Salman bin Abdulaziz Al Saud in Riyadh, Saudi Arabia and eventually became the de facto ruler of the kingdom. Prince Salman is also known as the Prince of Saudi Arabia. His leadership is responsible for several ambitious and forward-thinking projects including Vision 2030, Niam, and the Public Investment Fund, among others. Prince Salman is one of the royals who might be considered to be among the wealthiest and most influential members of the elite. The Red Sea Project, the Kidia Entertainment City, and the Saudi Green Initiative are just a few examples of the groundbreaking enterprises that have contributed to his global renown and prominence. Today, we are going to have a look at the extremely valuable possessions that Prince Salman himself owns, which will allow us to get a glimpse into the realm of his billions of dollars. Prince Salman's riches are on full show, and they can be seen in everything from futuristic cities to breathtaking artworks. Number 10. The Bugatti Chiron At the 10th spot on our list is the Bugatti Chiron, which is often considered to be among the most unique and expensive automobiles produced anywhere in the world. The Bugatti Chiron is a hypercar that can travel at speeds of more than 400 km per hour and has a staggering price tag of $3 million. Not one, but two of these monsters are in the possession of Prince Salman. One of them is black, while the other is blue. According to reports, he purchased them in 2016, well before they were even made available to the general public officially. Pride Island in the Maldives, which comes in at number 9. Prince Salman's Island in the Maldives, which is a tropical oasis hidden in the Indian Ocean is ranked ninth on the list of the most desirable places to live. With a total area of 19 square kilometers, the Fafu Atoll was purchased in 2017 for around $100 million. It is home to luxurious resorts, villas, and beaches that are in immaculate condition. This unique retreat provides Prince Salman with an unrivaled level of seclusion and calm, thereby hiding him from the prying eyes of the public and the media. The prince is provided with a quiet sanctuary on the island, which is surrounded by beautiful landscapes and surrounded by azure oceans. This sanctuary allows the prince to bathe in utmost luxury while enjoying the tranquility of his private paradise in the heart of the Maldives. Chateau Louis XIV comes in at number 8. At number 8 on the list is the Chateau Louis XIV, which holds the title of the most costly home on the planet. A French palace from the 17th century serves as the inspiration for the design of the Chateau, which may be found in Louvachins, France. 10 bedrooms, 30 bathrooms, a ballroom, a library, a wine cellar, a movie theater, and a moat with a transparent underwater chamber are all included in the chateau's total area of 5,000 square meters. Additionally, the chateau features a cinema theater. The air conditioning, lighting, and sound systems in the chateau are all able to be controlled by an iPhone or other electronic device. With a staggering price tag of $300 million, the prince purchased the chateau in the year 2015. The Boeing 747-8 VIP jet comes in at number 7. The Boeing 747-8 VIP jet, which is the largest and most luxurious private jet in the world, comes in at number 7 on our list. In addition to having a range of 15,000 kilometers, the plane can carry up to 100 passengers. Not only does it have a master bedroom, but it also has a guest room, a lounge, a dining room, a conference room, an office, and a fitness center. The aircraft is also equipped with a security system, a missile defense system, and an entertainment system that is at the cutting edge of technology. In the year 2015, the prince purchased the jet for an astounding price of $400 million. Leonardo da Vinci's Salvador Mundi comes in right at number 6. On the sixth spot, we have the Salvador Mundi, a picture by Leonardo da Vinci that holds the record for the most expensive painting ever sold in the history of the world. In the painting, Jesus Christ is shown to be blessing the observer while holding a crystal orb around his head. Among the few works by the Renaissance master that have survived to the present day, this artwork is widely regarded as a masterpiece of both art and history. In 2017, the prince purchased the painting for a record-breaking price of $450 million, beating other buyers from all across the world who were also interested in purchasing it. In fifth place, The Oil Kings. Andy Warhol, an American artist, is responsible for the collection of oil paintings known as the Oil Kings, which comes in at number 5. There are several oil-rich countries in the Middle East including Iran, Iraq, Kuwait, and Saudi Arabia, and the paintings depict the leaders of those countries. The iconic series of portraits that Warhol created of significant personalities and celebrities includes these works as part of the series. These artworks were purchased by the Prince in 2015 for a value that has not been published. 
Nonetheless, it is thought that they are worth more than $500 million. Number 4. The Entertainment Industry The fourth category on our list is the entertainment industry, which is a sector in which the prince has made significant investments throughout his career. Disney, Netflix, Warner Bros, and Spotify are just some of the major corporations that the prince has invested in through the purchase of stakes. Additionally, he has been a producer for several critically acclaimed films, including The Hunger Games, Wonder Woman, and The Lion King. Additionally, the prince has been vocal in his support for the growth of the Saudi film industry, which has resulted in the production of several films that have won awards including Wajda, The Perfect Candidate, and The Message. Relax is the third option. Taking the third spot on our list is the Serene Superyacht that measures 134 meters in length and is considered to be among the largest and most opulent yachts in the world. In addition to having a crew of 52, the yacht features 15 cabins that may accommodate up to 24 guests. A submarine, several swimming pools, two helipads, a helicopter hangar, a fitness center, and a movie theater are some of the amenities that are included. In addition, the yacht features a snow room, a sauna, a library, and a concert hall at its disposal. A cool $500 million was paid by the prince to purchase the yacht in 15 years. The professional sports arena comes in at number two. In second place is the professional sports arena, which is yet another domain in which the prince has demonstrated a strong willingness to invest. Several sports teams, including Manchester United, Paris Saint-Germain, and the Los Angeles Lakers, have received financial backing from the prince on multiple occasions. In addition to that, he has provided hosting services for several international sporting events, including the Formula One Grand Prix, the WWE Crown Jewel, and the Spanish Super Cup. In addition, the prince has initiated the development of a brand new sports city known as Kidia. This city will have a ski resort, a theme park, a golf course, and a championship golf course. In first place is Neom. And lastly, at the top of the list, we have Neom, which is the prince's most ambitious and expensive initiative to date. The futuristic metropolis of Neom is now under construction in the northwestern region of Saudi Arabia, close to the Saudi Arabian border with Egypt and Jordan. A staggering amount of $500 billion will be required to construct the city, which will encompass a total area of 26,500 square kilometers. In addition to being powered by renewable energy, the city will be equipped with cutting-edge technologies such as robotics, biotechnology, and artificial intelligence of the highest caliber. In addition, the city will have a population that is both diverse and cosmopolitan, with an emphasis on innovation, creativity, and being environmentally responsible. The video for today has come to an end. We hope that you found the information about the 10 most expensive objects that Prince Salman of Saudi Arabia owns to be enjoyable. Which one of these things did you find to be the most impressive? Please share your thoughts with us in the comment section below, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more riveting content.